how to choose the right skirt length. Hemlines rise and fall like the stock market, but you'll always look great if you heed these tips. You will need the right shoes and a coordinating top, optional, and above the knee skirt. Step one, make the most of your frame with the right skirt length. A short skirt will add height to a petite frame, while tall and leggy ladies can pull off flowing layered skirts. Long skirts should be long enough to touch your ankle bones. Try on a variety of skirts to see which flatter your body. Always try on a skirt with the shoes you plan to wear with it. Step two, accentuate your assets. Show off toned legs in shorter skirts or a firm rear end in a knee length pencil skirt. Curvy girls will look best with a flared skirt that just covers the knee. Never let a skirt end at the widest parts of your legs, the calves and upper thighs. Step three, make sure your skirt length is appropriate for your age and the occasion. Even if you look great in a micro mini, it's probably not a good idea to wear one to work or around your grandkids. Step four, coordinate the skirt length with the style of top you'll be wearing. A fitted V-neck top won't pair well with a tight, short mini. A longer, flowing skirt creates a better balance. Tunic tops look great with short or narrow skirts. Step five, wear a skirt that falls right above your knees if all else fails. It's a length that looks good on all shapes and sizes. Did you know? In 1966, designer Mary Quant popularized the mini skirt, which hung six to seven inches above the knee. 